At LifeBreath, indoor air quality is of the utmost importance. Our products focus on providing fresh and healthy air for residential and commercial applications. To ensure optimal performance of our heat recovery ventilators, HRVs, or energy recovery ventilators, ERVs, a qualified HVAC technician must install and balance the unit to a desired and appropriate airflow. Balancing the airflows is critical to ensuring that the amount of air introduced to the inside of the building equals the amount of air exhausted to the outside of the building. If these two airflows are not properly balanced, the following issues may occur. A positive or negative pressure in the house. HRV or ERV may not operate at its maximum efficiency. The HRV or ERV may not defrost properly. What you'll need. In order to balance an HRV or ERV, you will need the following tools and supplies. Digital manometer, tubing, aluminum tape. Prior to performing the air balancing procedure, perform the following steps. Make sure all duct work is properly sealed to avoid any leaks with duct mastic sealant or metal duct tape. Confirm the installation and proper operation of all the components of the HRV or ERV. Fully open the balancing dampers. Turn off all household exhaust devices, range hood, clothes dryer, bathroom fans, and close all windows and doors. Set the HRV or ERV to high speed and make sure the dehumidistat setting is off. Plug the unit into the electrical outlet. If the outdoor temperature is below 0 degrees Celsius or 32 degrees Fahrenheit, ensure that the unit is not running into frost. If the system is a simplified or partially dedicated installation, operate the furnace or air handler at high speed. In this video, we are going to use the door ports to perform the air balancing procedure. Not all models have ports for balancing. Refer to the installation manual for your unit for additional balancing methods. Connect the applicable tubes to the low and high pressure sides of the digital manometer. Open the HRV or ERV door. Remove the four door pour covers by carefully pushing them out of the back side of the door. Close the HRV or ERV door. Refer to the installation manual of your unit for the identification and location of the door ports. Insert the tubes from the digital manometer into the stale air balancing ports. Using aluminum tape, seal the fresh air balancing ports. Record your reading. Insert the tubes from the digital manometer into the fresh air balancing ports. Using aluminum tape, seal the stale air balancing ports. Record your reading. Refer to the airflow reference chart in the installation manual for your unit to determine the fresh air and stale air flow rates. The default dip switch setting is high 3, so ensure that the correct column is being used. Using the balancing dampers, damper down the higher airflow and repeat these steps as required until both airflows are identical, balanced, or at least within a 10% difference. Install the four door pour covers. Here's how to use the chart. Your pressure gauge will tell you the pressure in either inches of water column or pascals. This will vary home to home because the duct configurations are going to be quite different. Then use pressure value on the chart and find the corresponding CFM for stale air, exhaust airflow column, and fresh air, supply airflow column. For example, Let's say the desired and appropriate CFM for a building is 160 CFM. When you first measured the supply airflow, you had 0.70 WG or 199 CFM. And in the exhaust airflow, your measurement was 0.80 WG or 179 CFM. You'd now have to adjust the balancing dampers on both supply and exhaust collars and bring down the airflow as close to 160 CFM on both sides. Which in this case, supply will have to come down to 0.87 or 160 CFM 
and exhaust 0.88 or 162 CFM. Note that though it's not exactly 160 CFM on both sides, it is considered to be balanced within a 10% difference. After the unit is balanced, you might want to double check both readings again as the adjustment on one airflow may produce a slight change on the other. Some fine tuning might be required. Now that you have installed and balanced the Life Breath HRV or ERV, the unit is ready to provide the building with clean, healthy, energy efficient fresh air. To learn more about a particular indoor air quality product, visit lifebreath.com.